All right, so I don't know about you guys, but this is something that I've been waiting for for at least five or six years now. And that, of course, is the Extreme Z Awakening for the Int LR Piccolo, the World Tournament LR Piccolo, the unanimous worst LR in the entire game until now. So. Uh, yeah, of course, in this video, we are going to be breaking down his full Extreme C Awakening details. But first, we'll start with his free Easy A details and find out exactly why he was known as the worst LR in the game. So, his leader skill is HP plus 150%. His 12 key super attack causes colossal damage. His 18 key super causes mega colossal damage. And his passive was defense plus 10,000 at allies defense plus 5,000. And yeah, that is about it. That is everything that he did. And of course, you got to keep in mind, you know, he dropped in 2016 for, for JP and early 2017 for global. So it's not like when he first came out, he was that terrible i guess he was at least usable with the defense but you know in today's meta like this is literally like having no passive this is like literally having no leader skill and uh, he just did nothing he basically did no things at all now let's jump over to the extreme z awakening and the translations are provided here by uh minato's flash on twitter so a big shout out and thank you to Minato's Flash, of course, for the uh, English translations. So let me just actually open this in a new tab so we can zoom in a little bit. Okay, so here we go. Int LR Piccolo, Extreme Sea Awakening. Leader skill, Q plus three. Uh, this was a mistake. It's HP plus 150% and then attack and defense plus 90% for all allies. So basically a rainbow leader skill. Um... Uh, attack and defense plus 90%, key plus 3, and then 150% HP. Uh, 12k super causes colossal damage and greatly lowers enemies attack. 18k super mega colossal damage and raises allies attack by 30% for one turn. And then passive is key plus 3 and defense plus 200%. Attack plus 200% based on remaining HP, the more HP remaining the greater the boost, all allies, key plus 1, and defense plus 20%. When there's a character whose name includes Gohan Kid on the team, then all allies, key plus 2, and defense plus 20% in addition. So if you have the uh, Kid Gohan on your team, then he's giving key plus 3 and defense plus 40% as his support passive. And then finally, when a character whose name includes Gohan Kid is attacking, in the same turn plus an additional defense plus 100% and guards all attacks in the first slot. That is by far the best part of this passive, the most uh, useful, the most exciting part of the passive. And uh, yeah, he's gonna be a defensive monster, man. I mean, this guy's gonna be getting, I think, somewhere between 400 to 500k defense and uh on top of that you factor in the guard and he's gonna be a really freaking good tank man he's gonna be a very good tank now offensively i don't think we should really expect too much from him because i mean that's not really what the card is meant to do right that's not what the unit is meant to do he's supposed to be a very very good defender and uh, that's exactly what he looks like he's going to be. Um, offensively, like, yeah, he'll do some damage. He'll, you know, like, he'll uh, do something. He'll do something offensively, but it's not going to be that much. It's not going to be something that's going to really uh, impress anybody. But I think he will make up for it in the defense department and... He's going to pair well with the uh, new LR Kid Gohan, right? The part two LR Kid Gohan. So there's also that. Um, he pairs well with a new LR, which is something that we don't usually get with these Supreme Z Awakenings. 
or at least uh, it's not like the most common thing, so that's always nice to see. And um, yeah, I just gotta say like, I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. I'm pretty happy with it. He's no longer the worst LR in the game, that's for sure. He's definitely more useful than, uh, you know, units like LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku and uh, all those other LRs that need Extreme Z Awakenings at this point. I definitely see myself running him, at least on uh, a couple of teams, Namekians for sure, and a few others, but um, yeah, good passive there, links are the same as before, team, same as before, but in case you guys don't know, Gaze of Respect, Prodigies, Brainiacs, First Awaken, Shocking Speed, Experienced Fighters, and Legendary Power, and categories are Namekians, Worthy Rivals, a Bond of Master and Disciple, Battle of Wits, uh, Gifted Warriors, Planetary Destruction, Saiyan Saga, and Earth Red Fighters. So that is the Int LR Piccolo Extreme Z Awakening. Um, I like it. I like it. He's not going to be crazy bro broken or busted or anything like that. You know, like don't expect the world from this unit because it's still a free to play world tournament LR Extreme Z Awakening at the end of the day. So it's not going to be game breaking, but. It's really good for what it's supposed to do, which is just be like a wall, you know, just be a great, great tank for uh, people that are maybe struggling with some events that hit really hard, right? So, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm good with this. I'm happy with how he turned out. And of course, let me know in the comments uh, what you guys think about this EZA. Are you as impressed as I am, or at least as satisfied as I am, or where you may be expecting more. I know that he definitely could have had more attack. He definitely could be doing more damage. But once again, that's not the purpose of this unit. So I think that's totally fine. And uh, yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. Uh, look forward to part two of the eighth anniversary celebration. I definitely will be doing some content for part two as well, uh, especially some summons. So definitely keep your eye out for that. And uh, that's the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.